Hey guys, welcome to Mark Gourmet Kitchen. Today I'll be showing you guys how to make a strong back cashew punch. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe, and also click that notification bell to get notified when I upload all my contents. All that I'll be using to make this strong back cashew punch will be listed down in the description box so you guys can just go there and get the full ingredients. <music> Javi Beats exclusive. Now here's all my ingredients that I'll be using to make my strong back cashew punch. You'll be needing cinnamon, mixed spice, peanut punch, some almond milk. You're gonna need a Medina strong back drink. You're gonna need a mighty malt, Guinness, condensed milk. You're gonna need your cashew. You're gonna need some oats. And here I got my sea moss gel that I made, otherwise known as Irish mush. You're gonna need some vanilla essence. You're gonna need a tin of nutriment and also some ground nutmeg. All the measurements for my ingredients will be listed down in the description box. Now guys, you're gonna need a self your blender to blend up some of these ingredients that I got in front of me here. Now I'm going in with my cashew nuts. This guy's cashew nuts is good for your body. It's rich in copper, zinc, magnesium, iron, and also boosts your immune system, guys. Got a lot of protein. Vitamin B6, Vitamin K, this guy is it. Just cash overall, it's just good for your body. Now I'm just gonna add this straight to my blender. So that guys, so I'm, gonna follow. Now I'm just gonna add my oats to that now. Oats is also good for your muscle. Now I'm just gonna add my sea mass. Gel. Now I'll be adding two tablespoon of sea mass to my cashew nuts here guys also sea mass is very good for the body guys I'm telling you if you don't have the sea mass guys you can use a tin of Irish mush you can get that to buy in your local supermarket yes guys but making that sea mass I will leave a link in the description box for how you can make the sea mass here it's really really good for the body guys it's full of so much benefits yes guys just going with a cup and a half of my almond milk. Guys, I'm just using the milk to free up the blender so it can blend the nuts and all the oats and especially my sea mass. Yes, guys. Now you just want to blend this about a minute or two. Yes guys, you wanna make sure you blend out all of those nuts, the oats, and especially the sea mass gel that I put in there. Yes guys, you wanna make sure you blend them out properly. No bits inside of it guys. You don't wanna have any bits into your punch when you're making it. Now I'm just gonna blend this and I'll get right back to you guys. Like that, guys. That's what I'm talking about. Blend out all smooth and cream, all of that. Oats, cashew nuts, this guys. And especially that sea mass. You want to make sure you blend them properly, guys. As I say, you don't want to feel any grain inside of it. You want to make sure you blend them for that minute or two. yourself a container where you'll be scraping out all of this cashew nuts and your oats into it so guys tell me it's all creamy and rich this strong back punch guys must try this strong back cashew punch guys it's really amazing I made it before so let me share it with you guys it's really nice all of the man them are putting in the work, especially for wifey or your partner. You need to drink that kind of punch up. You can get all of these ingredients into your local supermarket that I'm using here, except for the Irish moss that I made. Yes, 
guys. You can get that to buy in your head store. And we got the Irish moss at home. Yes, guys. I will leave a link in the description how to make your sea moss. Yes, guys. Or if you can't get the sea moss to buy, you can buy the Irish moss in your local supermarket too and add to it. Guys, look at that. It's beautiful. All creamy and nice, guys. Clean. Now, guys, I'm going in with my Medina Strong Back. Now, I'm going in with my Mighty Mouth. Also, my Guinness. That mix, mix up that mighty malt and that guineas into it. I'm telling you guys, this cashew strong back punch that I'm making is the ultimate, guys. And you give this a try at home, guys. I'm telling you, especially the man, them. Wow, when you drink this kind of punch, you want it to settle in your back for about a day or two before you start to put on the work and wifey. it. Girlfriend, yes, guys. Okay. Guys, it's so beautiful. I'm going to use my nutrient, guys. If you can't get nutrient, you can use a supplement. I'm going to give it a good shake for the additive. Also, my peanut punch. That peanut punch, so put it again together. It's time to add my spices into that now. Add my cinnamon powder, just a teaspoon of cinnamon powder. I'm going with my ground nutmeg, just a half teaspoon of your nutmeg, guys, not too much. So the same thing for your mixed spice, half teaspoon. You don't want to put too much of the mixed spice on the ground nutmeg. You don't want to get it too make it bitter. Nutmeg or the mixed spice to make your punch go bitter guys. So you don't want to use too much. Now you just want to mix out all of these spices that you just put in there properly. So guys, you see that they're forming any lump like this here. Make sure you mix it properly, guys. I'll get right back to you guys when I'm finished mixing out all of these spices that I just put in there nutmeg, the cinnamon, and the mixed spice. Yes, guys. Now, here you have it, guys. I mix out all of those spices my cinnamon, my mixed spice, and also that ground nutmeg. Guys, look at that. No lump, looking all smooth and creamy. This is how you want to make this delicious cashew strong back punch. So it's really amazing and really nice for the Monday. The ladies can also have it, but it's really good for the Monday. Now I'm just going with my vanilla. This guy is probably adding like a tablespoon. That. So now I'm using my condensed milk to sweeten it now, guys. One tin of condensed milk. So I'm gonna mix those in now to my cashew punch. And make sure you mix out that condensed milk properly, guys. You don't want it to settle down in the bottom here, so make sure you stir it well and mix it up good into your cashew punch. Chef Ricardo, if you have watched that video. I hope you get a cash up on shot try in the kitchen. Yeah man. This one is really amazing. Right, now there you have it. Finish mixing out all of that condensed milk and that vanilla that I put in there. And just give it a taste.
perfect. It's tasting delicious, guys. Really amazing. Now, guys, I'm just gonna rinse out my jug and I'll be chewing my cashew punch in and I'll get right back to you guys. Now, guys, here's my glass jug where I'll be pouring my strong back cashew punch in. Yes, guys, this is what I'll be storing it in. I'm just gonna pour that straight into my jug. Guys, look at that richness. Wow. Yes, guys, have some lean back. I'm just gonna pour this into my next jug. Pour that one into my jug later, but look at this richness, guys. I'm telling you, this is what you want to drink to build up your back. Especially when you do 9 to 5 and you're not holy for lifting. When you come home, you have to put in that work on wifey or your girlfriend. This is the kind of juice you need to make for put it back. Yes, guys. You don't want to add no ice to this, you just want to put this in the fridge. Leave it to cool, have a glass of it later. This guys, and leave it to soak in. Till all the next day you're profound. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yes, guys. I just want to say big up Chef Ricardo, big up Jamaica Recipe Queen, Mitchin Bo, Tyas Kitchen. Yes, guys, Chef Andre. Yes, guys, big up. I just want to say big up all my subscribers, the new ones and the old ones. Yes, guys, thanks for the love and the support, guys. I'm telling you, really appreciate it. Thanks for watching Matt Gourmet Kitchen. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit me up in the comment section, guys. Tell me what you think about this wonderful cashew punch. I'm going to give it a try at all. Yes, guys, it's really amazing. And it's really delicious, I'm telling you. I made it before, and I say, let me come and share it with you guys. Thanks for watching. Until next time.